to you. How are you? This thing rocks. Just an amazing light fixture. It used to be, in terms of when we talked about solar, solar was only for little walkway lights. Right. And it was only just enough light to prevent you from accidentally kicking the cat. It had nothing to do with security. You didn't really see that well. Solar doesn't always give you the amount of light that you want. Would you believe these are battery driven with regular flashlight batteries, four C cell batteries. This is a motion censored true LED spotlight. And at $29.98, 45,000 of them have already been purchased by QVC customers. Yeah, because they're super bright. They're 280 lumens. You can mount them permanently to a post, the wall, whatever right. you want. All you add is your four C cell batteries when you get it home. We also give you a mounting bracket that if you want to mount it onto a post up to six inches wide, you can do that. Yep. Because the one thing I don't like being a handy guy is electricity. I'm I, not good with it. Plumbing and so electrical are the two things you just, and I won't tackle. It's a challenge for me. I, I agree. So this is so much easier. All you do, get it where you want it, mount it, whether pick your favorite color, whatever it may be, put your batteries in it, and then it works off the motion. So when it senses motion, it goes on. This little, looks like Epcot. That little ball has all right. these little facets to it. Whenever it sees motion, more than 180 degrees, half a circle, it flips itself on and it stays on as long as you have motion. Now, I have a fixture on the side of my garage that is wired, hardwired into my electricity. That fixture eventually broke and it cost more money just to buy the fixture than it cost for these and because I will not mess with electrical, it costs me twice as much to go ahead and then have it installed. Um, I have these. Yeah. I installed them myself. I love them. I swear by them. I have one right by my big old gate that swings on open when I'm leaving. That and way when the, when the puppy has to go out. Right, exactly. And I have one can. on the side of my house, too. Yeah. It's easy to use. I installed them myself. I bought three sets. Love them. I have I one. I love them. They make me feel better. Well, it is true mm -hmm. security lighting, mm -hmm. and that's what that's what you want. I use one inside of a barn shed that has no electricity at all. Oh, right, exactly. And it's too far away from my main barn. Uh, let me rephrase that. I'm too cheap <laughs> to pay an electrician <laughs> to run electricity. To go out board there. that place, no. right? Exactly. So we put one back there. And by the right. way, just the mm -hmm. movement of my arm just set that off. And that's the thing, I mean, where, depending on where you're at, the motion sensor, and you can pivot the motion sensor, because that light is kind of facing straight at Dan, but the motion's more at a 45 degree yep. angle. You can position the motion sensor to wherever you want, so if it's not straight on, we can adjust those lights. We just have it on one of the thin poles back there, because we use the bracket that comes with it. So that's the great thing about it. I have one of these inside my garage. I built my house. Right. I put the switch 22 feet inside the garage <laughs> door and wasn't thinking. So that was a 22 foot obstacle with kids and bikes and all that stuff that I could be walking over. Put it in the garage, open the door, goes on, instant peace of uh, mind. It, it works. And by the way, I'm still on the same set of, of four C cell batteries. Well, yeah, because it only stays on as long as it senses the motion. Okay. When the motion goes away, the light turns itself off. So they're not constantly running. The other thing too is you saw that we had them where they were flashing yep. and I'll just turn this guy to the flashing mode by simply turning this. You can have them so they are set up as security lights if you want to. So that if someone walks into the backyard or wherever it may be, they flash. The other good thing is you can have it set so it not only does that at nighttime, but also During in the, the day. daylight, yep. which you're not gonna find that in the home stores. Okay, a couple different things. There are now four different colors. When Sean first brought this to us, we had the black. Now we've got black and white. The white, the white is always, always. one of the most popular yes. colors and it is already the most limited. I think we have 300 of them in our inventory. The company that brings this to us, IQ America, uh, they're a growing company, but they're still small enough where it takes us a while to get inventory. We've got the bronze, that's a, the champagne actually. Right. You've got the bronze in your fingertips. There it's mounted to a tree. You can mount these things anywhere. That's the great thing. You take that bracket again up to six inches. You can mount it on the tree limb. You can mount it on a post. You can put it on the side of your house. You can put it indoors. You can put it outdoors. It's safe for the rain, the sleet, the snow. It does not matter. Cold you, temperatures don't affect it. Cold temperatures don't affect it. And as soon as it senses that motion, I have two of these outside. I have two dogs. They walk off the patio steps. Right. I have it 40 feet away over on my shed. 
One goes on when they're walking down the patio steps. Then when they go out into the backyard, I have one on the other side of the shed. I want to know that my pets are still in sure. my yard. We live out in the country, there's predators out there. So it's peace of mind for me to be able to see the dogs in the backyard. But I also gave one to my mom and dad because they have this one step right. walking into their house. Yep. And my dad's like, oh, it's only one step. But that's, sometimes that's all it takes. It, it, yes. I want that step to be illuminated so when they're coming in and out in the darkness, they can see what's going on. It's just simple. It's putting light where you wish it to be and being able to do it simply, easily. 250 lumens. Uh, LED lights, flashlights are, are judged in lumens. Yeah. This is very bright for battery operation. The brightest I had ever seen for battery operation. And we frosted the lenses on these because they so are so bright. it's not too harsh. Yeah, because yeah. sometimes if there's so much light, it's distracting. These aren't. They light up everything. They light up where you're walking. They light up the steps. And, and they're adjustable. And they're independently adjustable. A lot of the ones in the home stores, they face in right. one direction, in one position. I can move this one here. Yours is down. This can be up. You adjust it to where you need the light. So places where you put it. You put it at the top of the stairwell on the basement steps. Perfect. So that you can see those stairs even in a power outage. You put them in areas of security where you light up, for most people it's lighting up the four corners of their home. For you and me, it's that back step at the deck where when I let the dogs out, I want to be able to see where they are. Right. Or for me, with that shed that didn't have electricity in it, I'm still working. Do you notice two things? You mentioned, I already asked you about one of them today. You notice when you got up this morning it was a little chilly? It's also darker, uh, longer. Uh, yeah, have you noticed it? It's right, darker, are shorter, longer, so. and it just sneaks up on you. It's only going to be a few more short weeks before we're looking at each other going, man, well, it's getting dark at 6, 6.30, 7 o'clock at night. As soon as we turn the clocks back for daylight savings, then you're dark a yeah, lot of the time. That's so exactly this right. This is so much easier. You could put this in a Get closet if you want. If you have a big closet that needs light, you could put that in the closet. Oh, that's, that's a great right, idea. You can use it in your garage. You can use it in your shed. You can use it out you know, on the fence. You can mount it high. You can mount it low. You do not run electricity to it. You put in your four C-cell batteries. It's $29.98. Now, you and I both know that there's a lot of pl you know, cheap plastic stuff out there in the industry. It's not as bright, it's not as durable, it doesn't work as well. The motion detectors on these are the same that are used on high-end electrical units that have to be hardwired into your house. Right, and you can move that. This is the motion detector down here, so I can pivot this from one direction to another. Yep. Most of them, they're fixed, pointing straight out, but I may have it mounted this way, but all the traffic comes from this angle. Hey point your motion sensor to Towards that angle it. where now, it's at so it uh, goes on sooner. I hate to interrupt you, white just sold out. Uh, we have black, we have champagne. Hold up the bronze. You're a good model. Like That's that? pretty good, that works. Uh, the bronze is the next one in which to sell out. Uh, and it takes us a while to get these back in. 45,000 QVC customers have picked them up. Rachel, my co-host, she moved into her first house. So excited for you on that. Uh, it was a busy month moved into her first house and also got her first dog. Yeah. I, did. I got my first yeah. dog, first house, first dog. But I love that um, you got these but I, but and I you bought did it these. yourself. Yeah, and I did it myself. That was the other thing. And that mine it's go, a screwdriver. Over, go over the fence. Okay. On my, so I have them bracketed over a fence. And it's really easy and it makes me comfortable. I know that when I come in, that light's going to be on when I swing open that door. Right. Anything I need to see, boom, it's the light is there. Let me ask you this, and I'm asking this not as a host, but yeah. as a consumer. Mm -hmm. Were you surprised at how bright they were in an actual yard environment instead of just here in a studio? Yes, and in fact, I tried all the settings. So I tried I tried to have the setting on where they came on day and night, and then I was like, I guess I don't really need those on no. during the day. And my dog now running around in the yard, I'm like, oh my gosh, it's going on all the time. But it's, all, yep. it's awesome. I love that I had that choice of setting as uh, well. Your batteries should last a long time. Mm -hmm. Again, they're only on when you've got motion. Right. Uh, but for a potential burglary situation, mm -hmm, absolutely. the last thing the bad guy wants is light or, is attention. Light or attention. I right. agree. If you have it in the flashing mode, you're definitely going to draw attention, especially yeah. you can do it in daylight. If you just want to turn it to light, which most people use it in Wh which light Which I have function. learned, the flashing light, though, by the way, doesn't bother raccoons at all. No, not really. They just look at it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. We're, we're going to go off and say hello. Gloria is here in Pennsylvania. Hi, Gloria. Good morning. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Doing really well. It's my buddy, this is Sean Pickford. Good morning. Uh, hi, it's nice to meet both of you. Where will you put yours? I'm gonna put them out by my deck. 
Okay. okay. I have a spot in the back that's dark, and when I go around the back, I don't want to walk into the bear or the skull. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so let me let me guess. You live uh, somewhere near the Poconos here in Pennsylvania? Yep. I live in Stroud Township. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, so for the folks who are not aware, when Gloria says she doesn't want to run into the bear or the skunk, she ain't kidding. No. Okay. No, no. Yeah. And we have a bear who has three cubs right now. So. Okay. Even yeah. even better. That's cute. Better but you to don't want to be caught between them. So. So lighting is important uh, for most animals. By the way, they're the same way. If a light comes on, it startles them, and they move along. Uh, it, it's your property. You want to make sure that you're keeping yourself safe. If you have pets, your pet safe. And I don't know about you, just because it's getting darker earlier, that's not going to keep me from wanting to be outside. Right. I right. bet that We're deck outside. is gorgeous. I'm in and out all the time. So. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and you can use that mounting bracket that you get with it, Gloria, or if you want to put it up permanently, we also give you the screws so you can screw it into your fence or whatever you're going to mount it on. Yep. Yeah, that's what I looked at, too. I thought, oh, that'll be easy for me to do instead of asking someone else yep. to put it up for exactly. me. Yeah. Like Rachel said, she did it herself, so and, it's that easy. They're great yeah. quality. They're surprisingly bright for battery operation, and it's just a, a very good quality item that solves that, that problem that you were talking about with critters mm -hmm. in your backyard. So. Right. All right, they're on their way. We'll have them to you quickly. Gloria, thank you very much. Thank you, and Appreciate have a nice day. It. You too. Bye-bye. You know, if you have skunks in your backyard, it's important to tell if it's the neighbor's black cat or if it's not. Yeah, because after you go to pet it and find <laughs> out, it's a long time. Yeah, it's so. a bad day, isn't it, dude? <laughs> we, I've been, we've been through that We've one before. There, so. <laughs> Last call on the bronze that Sean's holding up. 300 remain in the bronze. The white is gone. We have black and then we also have the champagne. They all work equally as well. Yeah, they're super bright, 280 looms. Wait, come on out, come on out here, because yeah. they may not be able to hear you. Well, I was just saying that I have the champagne, and if you didn't get the white, you just get the champagne. No, I mean, you it's just, fancy. it's a nice, it's an easy, whoa, it's, it's an easy trade. If you missed out on the white, the champagne is, is, is yeah, unobtrusive, it's and it's kind of yes. classy and elegant, exactly. exactly. And I have it on my wood um, fence, uh, just along two different places they, they on my fence, which make it really until easy. Until they light up. Yep. Right. So again, now, this is what's interesting. We've got one over here, and it doesn't take a lot of motion yeah, to, that, that, that was it. Yeah. That was it. And, and that's and the it great comes thing. On. They're, they're sensitive, and that's what you want. You want it to sense the motion. You want it to stay on. As long as that motion's there, when the motion's done, it goes off. That's why the batteries last a good long time. Uh, and all you need is four C-cell batteries. That's it. Uh, the color that Sean is holding, that'll be gone here soon. We only have a few hundred of that. That's in the bronze. White's already sold out. Uh, the black is what I use at my place, and then champagne is what she uses. Perfect. Where'd she go? Where'd that woman go? Come, come, come. Um, so, did you have fun today? I had a great time. I always have so, fun. I did say that I started the Thanks, day buddy. with a backward shirt, vonking my head, and waking up an hour.